To sharpen an anterior scaler, slide the spine of the blade along the groove in the blade positioner with the blade face up so that about one third of the blade extends past the bar. Support the instrument handle loosely. Lower the bar onto the blade face by turning the knurled outer ring clockwise. Be sure to tighten the outer ring securely. Position the jaws so that they completely surround any straight portion of the scalar shank. Place a finger on top of the tip clamp to stabilize it as you tighten the jaws. Turn the rear knob clockwise to tighten the jaws and clamp the tip. Make sure to tighten the knob securely. Then tighten it a little more. Release the blade from the blade positioner by turning the outer ring counterclockwise. By grasping only the tip clamp, move the instrument from the blade positioner to the sharpening cone. Press the red power button on the front of the machine to start the cone. While only holding the tip clamp, move the instrument toward the cone and lightly trace each cutting edge from heel to tip. Press the red button again to turn the machine off. Before removing the scaler from the tip clamp, extend the scaler beyond the side of the machine and check your results with the test stick. If your blade catches on the test stick, it is sharp and you can remove it from the tip clamp. Extremely dull blades may require additional sharpening. Check for sharpness after tracing each cutting edge. Take care not to apply too much pressure against the cone or slip off the cone as you reach the pointed scalar tip. Remember that scalar blades are triangular in cross section. No matter how a scalar is sharpened, it is possible over time to develop a sharp edge on the spine of the blade. If this condition is present, simply slide the spine of the scalar through the diamond groove in the instrument new wrench to round the spine. To sharpen a posterior scalar, Slide the spine of the blade along the groove in the blade positioner with the blade face up so that about one third of the blade extends past the bar. Support the instrument handle loosely. Lower the bar onto the blade face by turning the knurled outer ring clockwise. Be sure to tighten the outer ring securely. Position the jaw so that they completely surround any straight portion of the scalar shank. Remember that the positioner is holding the instrument in the correct position for sharpening. Therefore, the tip can be clamped on any straight portion of the shank. Example, on this scaler, the straight portions of the shank are here and here. Use the dial on the bottom of the tip clamp to raise or lower the clamp to access either of these areas. Place a finger on top of the tip clamp to stabilize it as you tighten the jaws. Turn the rear knob clockwise to tighten the jaws and clamp the tip. Make sure to tighten the knob securely. Then, tighten it a little more. Release the blade from the blade positioner by turning the outer ring counterclockwise. By grasping only the tip clamp, move the instrument from the blade positioner to the sharpening cone. Press the red power button on the front of the machine to start the cone. While only holding the tip clamp, move the instrument toward the cone and lightly trace each cutting edge from heel to tip. Press the red button again to turn the machine off and test for sharpness with a test stick. If necessary, smooth the spine of the posterior scaler with the diamond groove in the instra new wrench. Jackets are scalers with flat, straight blades. With instra new, both anterior and posterior jackhead scalers can be sharpened just like their sickle scaler counterparts. Use the same simple three-step method. Position the blade, clamp the tip, and sharpen the blade. Hoe scalers have a single straight cutting edge across the front of the blade. With the blade face up, slide the hoe scaler under the positioner bar. Because the blade is short, it will not extend beyond the bar. Support the instrument handle loosely. Lower the bar onto the blade face by turning the knurled outer ring clockwise. Be sure to tighten the outer ring securely. Position the jaws so that they completely surround any straight portion of the scaler's shank. Place a finger on top of the tip clamp to stabilize it as you tighten the jaws. Turn the rear knob clockwise to tighten the jaws and clamp the tip. Make sure to tighten the knob securely, then tighten it a little more. Release the blade from the blade positioner by turning the outer ring counterclockwise. By grasping only the tip clamp, move the instrument from the blade positioner to the sharpening cone. Using both hands to securely guide the tip clamp, Lightly trace the cutting edge of the hoe from right to left across the cone. Check your sharpening results with a test stick.